everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Victoria Montefusco and I'm a lover of all things when it comes to beauty, makeup, and fragrance. And today is going to be part two of my Sephora Holiday Savings Event Haul. So I did decide to make a second order because one of the products that was on my wish list for a while came back in stock. So I decided to snag that up and two other items. This is just a little mini haul. It's smaller than the previous haul that I posted, but I wanted to show you the products that I purchased just in case you all were curious. And also because I enjoy sharing what products I've been trying and enjoying and all of that. So if you are interested in seeing what I purchased, then please keep on watching. All right, so first I'm gonna start off with a repurchase, and that is this fragrance right here. This is the Juliet Has a Gun Pear Ink. I guess this isn't technically a repurchase because the original spray that I got was like a deluxe sample that I received from a previous four order, but this is my first time actually purchasing the fragrance. I decided not to get the full bottle because the full bottle for these fragrances is about like $100, $120 depending on the size that you get. And the lasting power on this fragrance isn't the best. So I didn't want to purchase a full bottle. So I decided to go for the travel spray. This fragrance to me is just the perfect pear scent. It's like sparkling pears, just taking a bite out of a pear that you got fresh off the tree. It's just absolutely beautiful. This scent is so, so stunning. And I really enjoy wearing this scent actually at nighttime. I like spraying this when, after I take a shower, when I'm in my pajamas, just trying to relax, you know, watch some TV before I go to bed. To me, this just puts me in a very relaxing, calming, zen kind of mood. And I know that once I'm finished with the previous deluxe sample size that I have, which I'm very, very close to finishing, I knew I was gonna miss having this scent in my collection. So that's why I purchased this. If you wanna hear about notes, all of that, I do have a dedicated video on this fragrance. You should check that out if you're interested in that. But to me, this is just the perfect like pear, slightly musky, but not so musky that I think it's gross, you know, kind of fragrance. The Lasting Power, again, isn't phenomenal, but I really do like this fragrance and I decided that I wanted this travel spray in my collection. So this was the first thing I purchased. The second thing I purchased from the Sephora sale, my second order, um, was this lip gloss duo. So this is the Just Add Milky Lip Gloss Duo. This retails for $22. Um, it's a $28 value, um, but I, I love these glosses. If you all know, uh, I've talked about the Tower 28 glosses a lot on my channel. I really, really enjoy them. So this is a new, um, this, this brown one is a new shade. It's called, um, uh, let's see, it's called Chestnut. So this is, this is a new one, and then this is the uh, Chill shade, this clear one, which I have a very, very tiny mini of the clear shade, the Chill shade, and I'm almost out. So I knew I wanted a replacement of that, and I'm almost out of my other milky gloss that's like a brown color. So I decided to get this set because it was a good deal, and I really enjoy this formula. So I'm wearing the Chestnut shade today on my lips. I really enjoy it. I love this formula. Um, and I love this color. So this is a phenomenal set. I just really enjoy Tower 28's products. So this was the second item that I got in my haul. And last but not least, the item that's been on my wish list for forever, and I finally decided to pull the trigger on once it came back in stock during the Sephora sale. And this is the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Beauty Light Wand. And this is in the shade Spotlight. This is a highlighter. This is made in Italy. It's a liquid highlighter. It's that classic Charlotte Tilbury like sponge tip kind of applicator. And I am wearing this on my face today. I also wore this yesterday. This is a beautiful, natural looking highlight, kind of like a glow from within. I love liquid and cream cheek products. So this is just phenomenal. I also have the shades Pinkgasm and I have one of the bronzer wands as well, the contour ones. Um, and I really enjoy them both. So I knew I was gonna like this formula. Um, this has been out of stock like everywhere for a really long time. So when I saw it come back in stock at Sephora, I knew I wanted to pick it up and I do not regret it. I really like it. And I think it looks beautiful on my face today. And it lasts all day. I will say that it does last all day. So that is it for my quick Sephora sales event haul part two. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I have seen reports online that there is going to be another Sephora sale 
20% off for everyone, no matter what your level is in Sephora Rewards at the beginning of December, I believe. Um, and so that's just gonna be a one-time purchase. You can't use the code multiple times. But I did see that that's coming up soon, so maybe I'll be doing another Sephora sale kind of haul video if there's other things on my wish list that I've been wanting to purchase. But between the first haul and this haul, I'm very happy with the items I purchased. And I've just really been enjoying um, the, the products that I've, that I've used, whether that's fragrance or makeup. Um, I really, really think hard about my Sephora wish lists. Um, these are not things that I just add to willy nilly. I really think about my purchases. So I am happy with all of these products and I really enjoy them. So if you like this video, please like this video. It helps out with YouTube algorithm and it also helps me know what kinds of videos you'd like to see on my channel. If you like me, please subscribe. I'd love to have you all here. I post two, three times a week. And if you have anything to comment down below, any questions about these products that I've purchased, if you wanna tell me what you purchased during this Sephora holiday savings event, I'd love to hear that, so just let me know down in the comments. So thank you for taking a little part of your day to spend time with me, and I will see you all next time. Bye.